Hey everyone, welcome back. It's Dr. Frank Wen from Integrity Chiropractic. If you've been wondering why you haven't seen me for a while, it's because I've been pretty busy this spring and summer with my free time, tearing up my yard and redoing everything. And in the process of doing that, it kind of got me thinking. I often have a lot of patients that come in and see me complaining about low back pain from pulling weeds all weekend. So I wanna see if we can help that out a little bit. In today's video, I'm gonna review four stand-up weed pullers that I think are pretty interesting, and I'm gonna tell you what I think about each of them. Let's get going.
Okay, so here we are at a local community center uh, by my office. Uh, as you can see on this hill, there's a whole bunch of weeds here. Uh, I already checked with the front desk and they said, totally cool with me uh, pulling a few of them out. Probably most people aren't gonna say no uh, to pulling weeds. And so uh, I got the tools here and we're gonna try each of them out and see how it goes. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and pull a bunch of weeds from afar with each of the tools so you can kind of see it in action. Uh, and then I'll do some close-in shots so you can see uh, what the mechanism looks like for each of them. Uh, and so I'm gonna start with the uh, grandpa's uh, weeder here. I kind of found the first one I'm gonna go for. So pretty straightforward. Um, we're gonna center it over the weed. Uh, we're gonna press down in it. Uh, and then we're just gonna lean and pull it out. So here we go, first one. All right, and I step on it and I put my foot right there and pull it out and look at that. All right, pretty cool. And then see to get it out, I guess you just use your hands and you pull. Okay, that's grandpa's weeder. Let's try the next one. All right, so this one is the garden weasel uh, weed popper. So this one's a step and twist kind of mechanism. And then uh, it has a little spring here that you can eject it after you get it. So we'll go for this next one over here. So again, get right on the center of it. Um, I'm gonna press down and twist. Kind of bind up the roots. And then, nope, I don't think I did that one right. I'm gonna try this one over here. Let's try this one right here. All right, so step and twist. So I probably didn't step on it first the right time, so step go as far as I can go okay and I'm gonna twist here we go all right and it looks like I got it and then boom just go ahead and eject it all right so this is the Fiskars model um, and so similar similar mechanism um, except the has an ejection right here a little handle that I slide uh, but sim similar to the grandpa's weeder so let's go for uh, this one right here, I think that looks about center. I'm going to press down in, no, oh, press down in. Okay, I think I'm on it. I'm going to step on that. I'm going to pull. Hmm, I didn't quite grab it, so I don't think I did that right. So let's, I got most of it. So here it is. Let me try again. We'll go for this one adjacent. So I'll go ahead and center it press down okay i think i'm on it i think i'm deep okay and i'm gonna pull I'm not quite doing it right so i must be getting something wrong so loosens it up let's try one more let's try uh, let's try this guy right here okay so i'm going to push Okay, so I think the teeth got it. I'm gonna put right here on my foot, pull. Hmm, I am having trouble getting this thing to work right. Let's try one more. Let's try this one right here, this weed. So we got it centered right there. And we're gonna step. Okay, and I'm gonna put my foot here on the lever and pull. Oh, here we go. Oh, okay. So I didn't quite pull uh, the entire root out, it kind of broke there. Okay, so this one is the Garden Tech uh, four. Let's see, does that have four teeth? Yes, it has four prongs on the end of it. Okay, so let's go for this little weed right here. Okay, and so this one, the handle, I have it adjusted a little bit higher, but I think a uh, similar thing. It's got a little foot step right here. I wanna push down into it. Or is it this one? Yeah, there it is. Okay, I'll step it on the wrong one. Okay, so I'm all the way into the ground. Now I'm gonna use the lever and I'm gonna pull out. Okay, so it didn't quite grab it. Got a good, good amount of it okay but not quite all right let's try this one right here let's make sure i got this mechanism right okay 
So centered right there. I'm gonna step onto it with my foot. All right, so I've got it in there deep. Okay. I'm gonna step right there. Pull. Nope, didn't grab it. Okay, let's try this other one right here. Okay. All right, I think I'm in. I'm gonna step and pull. Okay, all right, this one got it this time. And then right here uh, is the eject. So we'll just boom, send it flying. Okay, let's do some close-up shots. So let's, let's start with the uh, grandpa's weeder again. So, so far using them all really quick. I like this one. This one's like super simple to use. Um, not too much thinking, not too many moving parts. It's pretty much just step, press, and pull. Uh, and so let's go for this guy right here. Okay, so you find the center of the weed. You step down right into it. Good. And then we use that as our fulcrum. And then it grabs and pulls out at the same time. Good. Let me try uh, another one right next to it. Okay, here we go, centered. Uh, step down all the way. Go ahead and step on the foot lever and pull. Okay, good. And it's out. Okay, so the next one I'm gonna use is, uh, I'm gonna use the garden weasel. So we're gonna center it, we're gonna step. Okay, I think that's as deep as I can get it. Okay, and so now I'm gonna twist. And I'm just twisting slowly because I'm afraid I'm gonna tear something, okay? So I like this, I kinda like this mechanism, it's cool. It kinda bunches it all up as you pull it out. And you got a nice core here. And uh, super satisfying to eject it. Let's do the other one right there next to it here. So, let's see. Make sure I'm on the center of it. Kind of hard to tell, but I think that right there is the center. So, okay, we're gonna put it right there. Step, okay, and then twist. So with the twisting, definitely there's a lot more effort that's needed compared to the other ones where you just step and grab. Okay, so it looks like I gathered it all up and then here it is. Okay, let's do the other one right here. Let's make sure you guys can see that on the camera. Yep, okay, so we're gonna step on it, push down. Okay, and I'm gonna turn, going clockwise. Nice. I got it, and then out it comes, and then boom, see ya sucker. Cool, so that's the Garden Wheels Weasel Weed Popper. So let's go ahead and uh, we'll try the Fiskers now. Let's move to another position. Over here, we got a whole bunch. Look at this big one right here. This sucker is huge. Okay, so that is one big weed. So let's see how the Fisker handles that one. And then uh, we'll also get neighbors right there too as well. All right, so just like I said, let's make sure I got everything set up right. All right, so I'm gonna center it right over. Okay, I'm gonna step. All right, I think that's as deep as I can go. All right, now I'm gonna pull. All right, it's giving me a little bit of fight. Hmm, didn't quite grab it out. It's like it slips away from the teeth as you're pulling it out. Let me try again. I loosen it up a little bit. Let's step on it one more time. Good. And then pull. Can't quite grab it. Let's try another angle. Okay, I'm pushing on it, stepping on it. Nope doesn't want to come. Let's try this smaller one right here. So we're gonna step. 
Okay. I'll lock that lever there, fulcrum, and we'll pull. Okay, so I kind of grabbed it out, but not quite. Yeah, I just don't know if I'm doing something wrong or is it just not grabbing things as well as I thought. But it does loosen it up where you can pull it out. But, you know, the whole point of you doing this uh, is to, using this tool is to try not to have to bend over much. Well, that's not helping us very much. So let's try, let's try a small guy, right? Right here, really small one. Should be easy. Okay, press down, step. Step my foot on there. Pull out. Hmm, didn't quite grab it. Okay, we'll try one more. Let's see, over here there's a nice patch of them. All right, see that big one right there in the center? Okay, we're gonna go for that. Okay, centered right there. Push down, step. Okay. Okay, this time I'm gonna do things different. I'm not gonna step on this foot thing. In the picture they have for ins the instructions, the guy's foot's not on it, so I'm just gonna pull. Okay, it worked a little bit better that time, but only about half of it came out. Okay, we'll try one more time on this one. We'll push down, step. Okay, and I'm gonna pull. Okay, this one did great. This one got it. All right, there's an another one right over here. Oh. We'll go for that one right here, this guy. All right, so I'll go ahead and step. Okay, and I'm gonna pull. Okay, so I didn't grab all of it. So, yep, I'm following the instructions as he got right here in the picture. You see the guy at the foot, step, pull, and then eject. It doesn't look like it's uh, grabbing it well enough that I can eject it. Okay, let's try the uh, guard tech up close. And look, there's uh, endless amounts uh, of weeds growing here so all right so let's go guard tech so we'll center it right there on that guy i'm gonna push okay and probably similar to the fiskers i don't, probably don't need to step on that i'm just gonna let it do the work and i pull out nope doesn't quite grab it okay let's try this little thing here i don't know what you call this plant kind of like a weed not quite maybe not not what you think of at least most people are thinking like dandelions and whatnot but all right same thing i got it i'm gonna keep, keep my foot on it this time i'm gonna pull oh okay all right that's doing a better job all right cool so i got it this time it grabbed a bunch so good and then yep i can inject it right there let's try uh this guy right there Okay, so we'll go for him right here. We'll center up. Okay, press down. Okay, foot right there. I'm gonna pull. Yeah, it just doesn't quite uh, grab it. It seems like with the two bigger models I have, uh, they seem to always wanna slip away from the teeth. All right, so after trying out all four of these stand-up weeders, uh, I'll have to say that uh, these two are my favorites by far. And the reason for that is uh, with the other two, uh, they kind of could get the weed, but it seemed to always escape uh, at the last minute uh, as I'm pulling it out from the ground. And so if you're trying to avoid bending over at all to pull weeds, uh, I don't think those two are gonna uh, help you accomplish that uh, as well as these two. Uh, these two, I felt like, you know, I was confident every time I was pulling the weeds out. Um, you know, sometimes you don't always get the, uh, the whole root, um, but I doubt any tool is perfect. Um, you know, I, I definitely like the garden weasel uh, a little bit more um, just because it neatly grabs everything into a nice bundle. Uh, and then if you have your a little bucket next to you, you can just like eject it into there and just go around the whole day and just collect them all up uh, and then bend over once to grab the bucket and dump it away. Um, you know, this one's not bad either. I could see though how sometimes uh, you might drop a weed here and there. 
not the end of the world you have to bend over and pick up a loose weed from the ground um, but you know this one you know you can be pretty confident it's going to grab it uh, every time uh, the only thing about the garden weasel is uh, it requires a little bit more effort because you have to twist it into the ground to uh, bunch up the weed uh, but that's still not that bad i think uh, definitely better than being bent over digging all day uh, so for that reason uh, this gets my number one choice uh, and grandpa's weeder gets my number two choice so i want to thank everybody uh, for watching uh, we have passed a thousand subscribers on this channel i appreciate uh, all the support and uh, all the likes and comments so be sure to like or subscribe if you're new and watching uh, to check out new videos that I'm making every once in a while when I got free time uh, for self-help. Thanks, I'll see you next time. I ain't gonna lie, this is actually pretty fun. Boom!